My name is Matt Dent. I'm a graphic designer living and working in London. Being asked to take part in the competition was incredibly exciting and um, it's been a, a real sort of education over the last few months learning about um, the Tang Prize and all it represents. It's been uh, really interesting learning about it. The ideas process was a difficult one. Um, difficult because the the outcome of the, uh, of the of the thoughts needed to be so specific. You know, it had to uh, be a design that represented everything about the Tang Prize. It had to be a design which would embody the the greatest of achievements and and the highest um, uh, recognitions. So uh, it was it was a difficult process, um, and I I began tackling it by mulling over some thoughts, uh, researching other other medals and the the aesthetic that uh, other medals seem to seem to have, trying to sort of assimilate all of that and come up with a design which reflected the, the history of medals and uh, also the, uh, the 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 contemporary day we live in, um, trying to sort of blend old with new and um, introduce a whole sort of suite of iconography that could represent the uh, diversity of the categories. The, 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 the medals, I decided to, to tackle the reverses first because I had an idea that, that hands would be appropriate. Um, I thought hands would be would be an ideal starting point because they represent human endeavor really and and that sort of theme is so closely tied to the the tang prize you know that it awards the the very highest um levels of endeavor and, and ingenuity so that sort of concept of hands seemed to be the the logical place to start and um what i wanted to do was to have have hands across all reverses, hands which would, would be different from one medal to the next, from one category to the next. And these hands, I thought, would, would interact with a set of icons and those icons would represent um, the category. And the way that they interact with one another, the, the hands and the icons, was, 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 was quite important to me. I didn't want the hands to actually physically touch the icons I wanted them to sort of the icons to to levitate above the hand sort of suggestive of of the fact that um, you know ideas are always reached for um, and ideas always uh, evolve and, and, and change and you can't really you know that they they're not physical you can't hold them in your hand um, and I, I like that sort of uh, approach to things you have a a set of four different hands and a set of four different um, icon sets, each one being different, but each one sort of feeling part of a set. So that was the starting point, beginning with the reverses, um, researching sort of hands, drawing different hands, photographing hands and, and working from that, and then working on the icons. And it was after I'd uh, felt sort of happy that I'd got a uh, you know a good route here, that I began to consider the the obverse and how that might work. So the way that uh, I tackled that was to 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 carry to carry over the idea of icons, but to set them in a in a ring rather than in a in a sort of a solid circle like we have on the reverses, but to set them in a ring, and they'd enclose the Tang Prize logo. And that um, solution was was quite satisfying. It, it sort of worked well in terms of the the area of the the circular area of the medal. It allowed um, uh, a nice space for the logo to sort of sit and breathe. And also, the ring could then accommodate the winner's name. And uh, the way that that works is there's a a plaque, a sort of a raised area set within the the, the ring of icons for the winner's name to be engraved. So that was the way the process worked, sort of thinking about the reverses, thinking about the four different themes, and then bringing those uh, ideas across to the obverse and uh, having that sort of obverse design uh, represent everything. You know, the, the ring 
includes icons of the four different categories so so therefore it represents the tang prize as a whole um, so it seemed a, a satisfying conclusion to the designs